talking about my channel today as always it's saba this thing is giving me a headache today is december today is december 28th friday night my sisters and i went out that vlog should be up before this vlog now i have to get my life in order i'm gonna just show you my room real quick this is the aftermath and then we're gonna do go puff for the first time today let me show y'all my room real fast you can see the horror Right now, I'm about to go put me a waffle in the air fryer. I would make a smoothie, but I really don't feel like making one. I got this new tripod because it's white and it's like real big. Supposedly, it's supposedly like 50 some odd inches, but it keeps like moving around and that's not what I wanted to do. So I'm like really confused right now, but the light is popping. <clears throat> You want one? No. But yeah, let's go clean up the room. Sometimes my eyes be looking like real, real eye. -y. Does that make sense? Ooh, they're like <laughs> an ocean. All right, let me go. <laughs> but I also have to go to Kohl's today to return this thing to Amazon. I just got the replacement yesterday, but y'all see how that's cracked? It's not supposed to be like that. This is what it's supposed to look like. And this is what mine looks like. Maybe it cracked because I'll be pushing, putting it too tight, but yeah. So now my little white tripod has a white foam mount. Let me clean this room real fast. is relatively clean i gotta take this downstairs that bag but other than that pretty good i'm leaving the yoga mat out to remind myself to work out that thing has been out for basically the past month i'm about to put this bag of stuff away i got two pullovers some marshals the other day. I had some stuff to return. So I only paid $11 for both of these. Got this purple pullover. Purple is my secret favorite color. And it's so weird that I didn't have any purple pullovers. I basically have one in almost every color except for orange. But now I have a purple one and it has pockets. And then I already showed you guys this one in white and it had a pink, like instead of this burgundy color right here, it's like a light pink. But then I saw that they had this pink one and at first I wasn't going to get it cause I'm like, Ugh, do I need it in every color? But then I thought about it and I was like, yeah. So I got this champion one, so cute. This also has pockets. This champion one was supposed to be 25 and the purple was 15. But like I said, I only paid $11 since I had a couple things to return. But yeah, I'm about to get ready to go and I'll see y'all in a second. All right, people, it is a couple days later. We ended up doing, well, we went to the, to the GoPuff place or whatever, but Basically, you sit there and you wait for them to bring an order out or whatever. So, we was there for a couple and, you know, we just turned the Uber on. I wanted to show you guys these slippers that I had got from Walmart. I basically got them. <clears throat> he got it. Yeah, he's making a smoothie. You want some smoothie? Yeah. All right, go downstairs. I'll be right there. These braids are getting on my nerves so bad. If I take these braids out, it's going to be the quickest I've ever taken braids out. I've had these in less than a week. So I got these slippers. They're by Bear Paw. I told y'all Bear Paw is like my new 
obsession. I used to not like them, but their quality is like top notch. Like, look at the bottom of your shoes. But yeah, they're paws by Bear Paw. I have a little strap in the back. I thought I wouldn't like that, but it really doesn't make any difference. These are men's. I got them from Walmart. The original price was $25, but I got them for $22. And then I also got the brown color. So yeah, two pairs of like little slipper things for less than $50, can't beat it. But these are supposedly they're never wet as well. So, so that means I could get them wet and they'd be chilling. Got these Ulanzi foam mounts. I also have a white one. I feel like I already showed y'all. But in all honesty, they're really trash. Like they don't hold the phone well. So I'm honestly thinking about returning the white one. I originally got these Ulanzi ones because they have like the cold shoe or whatever mount on there. And like ones like these do not. This is the one that came with the what you call it? Tripod. But I already had I can't remember if I got this one first or these first. I'm pretty sure I got the Ulanzi one first, but then I probably realized that it don't hold the phone that well. So then I got these and that's why I got these like little adapter pieces or whatever so that you could just screw stuff onto it right and so that was my biggest problem it don't ever screw on right so if i'm pointing this at me the thing is pointing to the side like what whatever so the point of the matter is I'm about to put these shoes on. And the only reason I got them, the only reason I got them was because for like pants like these, my boots or even like the little short boots or whatever that I have, they look stupid under yoga pants. And I'm gonna start wearing yoga pants again. So yeah, and they also look stupid. The short boots, in my opinion, look stupid with the leggings. Because like the, even though it's supposed to be like an ankle boot or whatever, it's too wide around the ankle. I only like them with men's jeans or like scrub pants or anything that's like bigger at the bottom. Let me show you what I got on. You really can't even see because it's all black. <laughs> this is why I don't wear all black no more. I really hate wearing all black, but yoga pants, this black shirt, and the shoes okay you guys this video has taken a turn i was supposed to go pick up my check today but the lady was not there and then i texted her she didn't text me back i really had no plans because today's the 30th i had no plans on going over there tomorrow the 31st i'm trying to chill but now i gotta go there tomorrow to erase H double hockey sticks and get my check this video is taking a turn because now I'm about to take these braids out. I know, I know, blah, blah, blah. Y'all don't even know how long I had these braids. I had these braids in for a month. I mean, a month. <laughs> a week. There's really no, nothing wrong with the, the way the girl did them. There's nothing wrong with the braids themselves, to be honest. But they are just so... They're just getting on my nerves, honestly. And I made the money back that I spent on them. So I figure it's just a wash. You know, you live and learn. I just don't personally like the hair that she used. And I knew I didn't like it when I got the braids. Because she put on her website that she used the model model hair. I don't like model model hair. And I thought it was the pre-stretch hair that I didn't like. But I don't like model model hair in general. And I mean, clearly people like it because they use it. But I just feel like maybe it's the blonde. I don't know, I've never tried the black, obviously. But the blonde hair is just too, it's, I don't like it. It's just real nasty and like it gets all tangled and it just don't feel good. I prefer, expression pre-stretched hair i don't know about expression regular hair because i've never used that but my favorite kind of hair is expression pre-stretched hair it comes in the four pack bundles or whatever is it's really nice and like it just feels good this is a mess 
like and i don't feel cute i don't feel pretty you know i know the braids don't look that bad but i just don't i have to take them out i have to deal with myself i have to like how i look so i'm gonna take these braids off after i'm done taking these braids out lord willing it don't take me that long i'm praying it don't take me that long because all it is individuals i'm just praying it don't take me that long after this, Lord willing, I'm gonna put a mask on. I might do a workout tonight. It is 9.25. Instead of sob day, it's ride day for my B-Day twin, my nephew. Even though we not B-Day twins, he was born a day after me, so yeah. Okay. Like, look at these ends. That looks horrible. That is horrible. So yeah, this has to go. We shall see how long it takes. This is what I'm talking about. Why I don't like this hair. See how ratty that is? Like, it's getting tangled as I'm taking the braid out. This does not have, I literally have not had this hair in for more than a week. I literally, today is Thursday, bro. Today is, wait, did I have this in for more than a week? Who did I get this done? It's been a week. It's been... I got it done, I think, last Monday. Right? When did I get this done? No. Right. I've had this in for a week and a half. On Monday, it'll be two weeks. And it's already tangled. Like, I don't understand. When I have expression hair in, it don't do this. Like, I really don't like model model hair. And I guess should I get my hair done by her again? I'm gonna just have to bring my own hair because... This is not it. I cannot do this. I think I had model model. And I had one other hair that I didn't like. I can't remember what kind of hair it was. But I had model model one time when I did my own hair or whatever. And I hated it. It was so ratty. This is disgusting. I mean, like I said, I don't know how the black hair is. Maybe since the blonde is color treated. Like, it's just real bad. But expression, expressions would never expressions expression whatever i don't know if it's singular or plural it would never all right change of plans y'all so i'm going to get my check and i was going to come back to y'all and let y'all know what's up yesterday but i was talking to my friends they called well one of them we're not friends no more <laughs> so i was talking to one friend and some other nigga when it was talking my head off whatever um i got done taking my hair out at one o'clock so it really wasn't super horrible i feel so much better now that my hair is and i'll go back to myself i feel cute and pretty so you know you know what can you do like i had the hair in for a week and a half i'm sorry about it i had to get it out so yeah i'm gonna get my check the lady texted me back so so i'm not gonna record it i was gonna record it but i'm just about to go pick it up real quick and yeah got my check my manager whatever she was really nice and stuff you know that made me feel good because i knew we didn't end on bad terms so i don't know why she wasn't writing me back but she said that she was sleep all day yesterday because her birthday was the day before so i'm like oh okay that makes sense so yeah i'll see y'all when i see y'all i guess i don't know 20 dollars that you can guess what i'm watching well here we are let me stop because y'all probably gonna guess what i'm watching so anyway I have started to edit this video a little bit. It is 11.33. I'm going to get in the shower, have me a nice relaxing, <sighs> nice relaxing shower. This is the first time in a couple that I've gotten one of these texts. But yo, like why, who, like honestly. I don't know who put my number on the freaking AT&T spam crap. But I wish they would take my number off. Stop texting me. This is the first time in a little minute that I got a text from them now. Like, leave me alone.
All right, y'all, so I got the mask on. I'm actually about to use this band that I bought off of Amazon. It's by Zubaz, whoever that is. But yeah, it's just a USB powered fan or whatever. And it has four speeds. It's on the second one right now. But yeah, I'm about to just use this fan to dry my face mask because it's 12:30, and i want to honestly be in the bed by one o'clock probably want to leave it on for no more than 10 minutes total i'll be back when i'm putting the turmeric cube on and then i'm going to end this video tomorrow morning and show you guys what my face is looking like i'll be back when i'm putting the ice cube on right this is what my face is looking like my teeth are looking real white. This is what my face is looking like after I took the, what's it called, coffee mask off. I'm gonna turn the light off so y'all can see it even better. Yes, this is what my face is looking like after I took the coffee mask off. I would put some honey on it or whatever to get the yellowness off, but it really doesn't even matter since I'm putting this turmeric thing on anyway. So I'm about to put this on. And then after this, I will probably do something to get the yellow residue off of my face. But I'm going to set a, another 10 minute timer. The time is now, I'm basically bracing against the clock. I'm not gonna make it to get in the bed at one. But I'm gonna set another timer for 10 minutes. And then I'm gonna rinse this off. And I will see you guys I don't know if the fan, if y'all can hear the fan or not. But yeah, I want to see you guys in the morning. Good morning. As you can see, we got some progress. Got some progress. My eyebrows are still kind of yellow from the mask, but it's okay. Stay tuned for my video of me using the mask for a week so you can know exactly what's in there. That's gonna be the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to do your good deed of the day and like this video, and if you're so inclined, you can also subscribe for extra cool points, extra blessings, extra kudos. <laughs> I'll see you guys in my next video, bye.